know what I'm saying? And, and, and left like that, yep. you know? And then, hey, we started going up. you going to do with that. Yeah, you can't even exactly. go and teach the other nations yet. You know what I'm saying? That's, 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 that's more to come. Yeah. But that's what it's all about. Because yeah. we're supposed to teach the other nations. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Right. That's all it's about. But before then, we got to get corrected and chastised and reproved. And, and the corruption has to come off. You know uh, what I mean? This is... And anger also came up against Israel because they believed not in the Most High and trusted not in his salvation. Yep. Though he had commanded the clouds from above. Yep. <laughs> they didn't believe out of all of the miracles that he did in the wilderness. And you know what? You know what the crazy thing is? Is that it's going to be people, niggas, and, and thoughts, right. and, and, and so-called uh, uh, peasants that's going to see wondrous works happen today. The so-called 21st century, supposedly, right? Okay. They're going to see things happen that they're not going to believe. And then we're going to tell them who it came from, and they're still not going to believe. And guess God. what? The Lord's going to kill your ass. He's going to judge you. Go ahead. Just like he did before. He said, uh, it said, that what was written the fourth time was for our learning. So, so we might endure and have patience all right and learn from these things you know and hey it's gonna be like like it's no director that can that can write yeah. but um there's no there's no director produced that can can uh write this script man that's gonna play out you know what i'm saying you know because uh you know you have all type of movies that come certain so-called uh disaster movies you know what i'm saying and people, yeah, apocalyptic type movies, and people, you know, they look at it, but you know, they don't, they don't like take it to heart. They don't consider, you know what I'm saying? Like, damn, could that really go down like that? Yep. You know what I'm saying? That's what it is. Too. You know, they just leave it on the screen, and that's yep. it. You know what I'm saying? It's two hours of entertainment. That was good. You know, yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? You know, you have a dinner and movie. You know what I'm saying? A movie and dinner, however, you know, you talk about what happened in the movie for the two hours, and then you know, you own with your regular old life, you know what I'm yep. saying? Not considering that the most high, you know, gonna bring dark days ahead. He just showed you, know? you a prophecy through yep. through these damn directors. Yep. He just showed yeah, you exactly. a prophecy. These movies are nothing but, uh, these movies like that are filled with nothing with foretellings and judgment and and and, and, and uh, chaos and uh, destruction that's gonna actually take place, you know? You know? So, yeah, when I see when I when I see movies like that, I say, damn, who gonna cover me in that day? You know, <laughs> because if a blackout yeah. happened again, which happened in 2003, yeah, woo wee, yeah, downtown right now. Uh, <laughs> man, be Boy, do you know how many um, cases that will be the 911 to be busy? Yeah, yeah. you know, uh, yes. It would I be mean, off the hook. it's 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 too. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Go ahead. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it'd be off the hook. You know, hey, 911 like, would be popping if, if downtown Detroit had a, a blackout like it did in 2003. Exactly. All right. You know, like, uh, I mean, just now with uh, society so called intact, you know, you got this construction like on every damn major freeway, you know every what I'm saying? Year. Every year. Every damn year, year in, year out. You know, it's hard enough sometimes from getting from one city to the next yep. just with the stretch so let alone it actually be Robot. you know yeah some some Check real shit that right. go down you know what i'm saying yeah martial law you yeah. know what i'm saying it's like what you gonna do now you know oh, what i'm saying man, these women Who, who's gonna call to in that day you know yeah. <laughs> right oh that shit gonna be dead man oh, yeah. oh, two thirds, they they gonna be bitches that day oh yeah the earth the earth yeah, the scriptures say the men are gonna be like women You got a precept? Nah, nah. Oh, okay. Just return where you started. Yeah, because then we're going to go back to Matthew chapter 13. Okay. Finish it. Okay. Um, this is Psalm 78. And. Salak. At 23. Though he had commanded the clouds from above and opened the doors of heaven and had rained down manna upon them to eat and had not given them the corn of heaven, man did eat angels' food. 
he sent them meat to the he sent them meat to the full. He caused an east wind to blow in the heaven, and by his power he brought in the south wind. He rained flesh also upon them as dust and feathered fowls like as the sand of the even, sea. Even how he even how he blessed us with that stuff, like it was a in a, it was a it was a miracle how he did the stuff, he, <laughs> how he he made the water to come up, how he made the the, the, the quails to come, you know what I'm saying? He, but but how did the quails come? He had made a, a damn uh, east wind. Did it say that east yeah, wind? East wind, uh, yeah. east wind come, and it was uh, you know that's a the miraculous work, you know. So and the the the, the way in such he. He, he made the miracles to happen were even miraculous, you know? God, that's spiritual. That, that, hey, that, that's a sign. You know. that's, that's a, a sign. sign. Like, you know, hey, that damn. lets you know, you know, the most high, you know, the, the ultimate power of the whole everything, universe, if you yeah, will, yeah. you know, he's got to be a Jake, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Because, hey, just us, you know, in our lowest state, you know, Hey, that's what Jake do. Yeah, you know, yeah. he makes something out of out of nothing. Like you know he saw walk like this, right? <laughs> he saw walk like this. Like a <laughs> well, Jake, we we can walk like this regular, right? We walk just regular, right? Uh, right. But we ain't gonna do it like that. We gonna do this. <laughs> hey, gonna walk with that. <laughs> 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 you know, hey, but that's just how we do everything, man. You know what I'm saying? Hey, that's spiritual in itself. You know what I mean? Uh, you know, our forefather uh, Jacob. Yep. You know, he wrestled with an angel. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. He got smote in his thigh. You know what I'm saying? And it's it's kind of in the spiritual sense, you know, that today, you know, yeah, that's Jake, man. He walked with that limp. You, yep. know, that flame, you know what I'm saying? You know, like, like what's wrong yeah. with you, Jake? <laughs> Shit, that was that angel. Right. And after about a couple months, he's like, fuck it. <laughs> you know? Um, it says, this is verse 27. And he rained flesh also upon them as dust and feathered fowls like as the sand of the sea. And he let it fall in the midst of their camp round about their habitations. So they did eat and were well filled, for he gave them their own desire. Right, hey, he gave you what you was looking for. Yep, you know? they asked that, That's yeah. what they was complaining and yeah, mocking him, exactly. yeah. uh, tempting him about, he still gave it to them. Mm -hmm. To show his power, they still was being niggas. Go ahead. Yeah. 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 And he let it fall in the midst. It's like it says. Uh, so they did eat and were filled, for he gave them their own desire. They were not estranged from their lust, but while their meat was yet in their mouths, the wrath of the Most High came upon them and slew the fattest of them <laughs> and smote down the chosen men of Israel. Right. So you know you might have had, you might have had like a, you know how when they have a. They have a, let's say, let's say something like this. You got a movie, right? You got, you got Friday. I use Friday for example. You got a, uh, Devo had his little two henchmen, right? Yep, right two henchmen right. in the next Friday, right? Right, right. So they were. He was the head of the uh, so-called the assholes, right? Right. right. So <laughs> then you had Craig. He was the head, right? Right. So uh, even the, the 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 fattest of them, the most biggest. Baddest warrior, whatever the Lord killed him. You know what I'm saying? He killed him. Right there. Go ahead. Someone held, someone held in a high regard, I guess, amongst men. Yeah. Yeah. Right now. Right. Yeah. It says, and the wrath of the Most High came up. Yep. So like, it. verse 32. For all this, they sinned still. And believe not for his wondrous works. <laughs> see, I told you, like, see, the, even the, the miracles were done in a miraculous way, a wondrous way, and they still didn't believe. That's Jake, man. You just yep. can't get right. You know? So, 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 how did it happen then? <laughs> there ain't no damn wind. Then right. you be yeah, like, yeah. a wind came and brought it, That's and then, then, the, then everybody be looking at you, and he, and everybody might sorry, believe right. you. But because he is held in high regard, uh -huh. they'll be like, he'll be like, man, ain't no damn wind. And then they'll be ha, 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 yeah, laughing with him and shit. Right, you you right, know, yeah, we yeah, encounter exactly. shit like that through all through yeah. life. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, whatever, all right, bro, whatever. You know, we're going to see. <laughs> exactly. Okay, hey. 
Yeah, we gon' hey, see. Lord got another East Wind yeah. coming through. Yep. In a minute says, uh, Fire East Wind. It says, For all this they said, Steal and believe not for his wondrous works. Therefore their days did he consume in vanity, and their years in trouble. Yep. When he slew them, then they sought him, yep. and they returned and inquired early after the Most High. Hey, it's too little, too late now. Yep. You know what I'm saying? And that's hey man, that's that's the story of Jake life. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> All, every time, you know what I'm saying? He get he getting the tight, he get hemmed up, he get locked Lord. up, some shit. That's the first thing you know. He caught oh, it. Hey, it, you know, it, it's that's real, man, because. Um, I'm just gonna say that's real, you know, because, you know, that's the first thing a nigga, you know, look for, you know, yep. he, he going to those little chapels, you know what I'm saying, in jail or whatever, you yep. know what I'm saying, uh -huh. you know, he trying, try, to find God. you know, trying to find God, you know, he want to read the Bible, he did every Sunday, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, even though you got, you got an Edomite, so-called white man, you, you know, bringing it out or whatever, uh -huh. you know what I'm saying, but it's just, he, he trying to do it. You know, he, he feel he trying to do anything, you know, to get in the graces of the Most High. Because he know in his spirit that it's some, you know, he being chastised, just chastised, basically. Yep. Yep. You know what I'm saying? That's he the know spirit. That. That's the spirit, you know? you know, because that's just like us, man. They're us brothers in this faith, man. We, we, we know it's coming. It's just a matter of when. That's the scariest thing about being in this faith. We yeah. know the Lord going to beat our ass. And he probably gonna kick us while we down a couple times too. Cause shit we did. And we deserve it. That's the thing. But we feel like, oh, you know, and you do feel like that, you know. Yeah. But when he starts to lighten the burden, you know, you, you know, it makes you cry when he's beating your ass and he's chastising you. But then when he lighten that burden and he have mercy on you, that shit make you cry too. That shit break Yo, you down man. too, cause you like, damn. He could have like, took me there, you know like he could have like, took me down, like you know, to the bottom. But he only brought you down for a little bit. He's showing you that mercy that we gotta display to one another, even the people that's outside of the faith. Right. And that's one thing I stress to you, brothers: don't be out here treating people like pieces of shit just yeah. because they're not in the faith. That's right. Hey, cause yeah, hey, you, yeah, hey, you can be in them shoes. You know yep. Real quick, the Lord Real can quick. he can you twist the table. You, you know what I'm saying? How do you think that we got this far? As a nigga, how do you think that Israel got that far back in in, the, in these ancient times, when the Persians was ruling, the Babylonians was ruling? You think we was out there, all of the whole nation was out there being assholes to all the nation? No, you have to humble yourself and understand you're not better than nobody else. Now, when you start to act like you are, the Lord will humble your ass real quick, and, and it could be detrimental. Cause you got, we got a lot of responsibility, man. And it, and when you start realizing that, it, it can it can be that can become become a burden as well. The being a priest for the Most High is, is a burden. You know, you even see the, uh, the 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 carnal priests today and the Catholic churches and the preachers at the pulpits and all that. It's a burden for them to to be in those positions. You know, so you know when it comes to the Most High Heavenly Father, when He speaks through the Spirit, it's a burden. And you always, you always um, are aware of it for the most part. And if you're not, you will become aware of it looking back on it, you know? But that's what you just gotta be circumspect. Don't be, you know, there's a lot of brothers out here that's, you know, all, you know, all of that stuff. It, it's okay if that's how you are and that's your personality, but you need to still recognize that you're supposed to be a light to the world. You represent the Most High, Yahweh Bashem Yahusha, which means you need to be temperate and balanced. All right, and that's all it is. You know what I'm saying? So just, just always constantly examine thyself. That's what you want to do. Not when we, when we, when we're not, when we're, when we're throughout our daily walk in life. You know, always examine yourselves. We gotta be wise as serpents, harmless as dogs. You know. Uh, quick precept. This is uh, <clears throat> Isaiah 57. If 15 for thus saith the high and lofty one that inhabiteth eternity whose name is holy I dwell in the high and holy place with him also that is of a contrite 
and humble spirit. See, the Heavenly Father said He dwells with those that are humble and uh, that are of a humble and contrite spirit, right? Uh, my, 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 my ex demon, right? Her mom, right? So called Catholic, right? Went to school, so called for uh, what, what did they call this shit? Welfare shit? Uh, uh, social work and shit, right? No, no, knows this people, know these people having a hard time. Know they're on hard times and everything. Or walk in their house and say they, they will call CPS on them. Mm. But you're supposed to be a woman of God. You're supposed to believe in the Heavenly Father. But you see somebody down and you threaten to call CPS on them when you're supposed to be a woman. How about you help them out so they won't be in that position? So you need to always stay humble and check yourself. Even when you get angry, it's hard. It's hard, man. It's hard. Especially, especially if you know you work for the Heavenly Father. We got contracts with the Heavenly Father. So we can't go and do things all like everybody else can. Because we're not ignorant. We're not oblivious. We're not naive to the judgments that will come behind those. So because we know the judgment that will come behind those, we can't do everything that everybody else does. Somebody can go and attack somebody and feel nothing for it. But because we know the Heavenly Father, we, we can't go and do that and feel, if we do that,